Hi, in this video for the Humax HB1000S, we're going to take you through the first time install menu, okay? So when you turn on your box and you have it connected to a satellite dish and you um, have it connected to your TV using the HDMI cable, which would be the normal thing, just uh, turn on the box and you'll be presented with this screen. So the first thing you'll do is hit the OK button to go next. So the next menu here will give you um, you know, the option to set up your screen and resolution and things like that. Pretty much what's there would be you know what's standard enough so you can just hit ok to go next again so what it'll do here and why it's important to have your box connected to a correctly aligned satellite dish um, is that this automatically just basically searches for the satellite signal and auto tunes the box and it's a very quick process and you'll see that here now in a second and um, so the type of dish that you would connect this to would be something like your existing um, sky dish or something like that okay so you can see here that it's come back and it said the signal test is good and this uh, this trend quality is very good so that's grand so the next thing is press ok to go next and what you do with the next point here is you enter a valid UK postcode. Now the vast majority of people in Ireland um, would be used to getting the regional variations from Northern Ireland so what we'll do in a second is we'll enter um, a postcode for Northern Ireland but equally you could enter one for Manchester, you could enter one for uh, London you know etc etc and that would give you the regional variations for there and where it might come into play a lot uh, regarding that would be kind of news programs and things like that. Uh, they would be more centered on that particular region. But as I say, most people just use um, Northern Ireland. So that's what we're going to do here. So we'll just use the remote control and the arrow keys and we'll just enter a postcode for Belfast. So it'd be T11 A A. Okay. So we'll just arrow down as far as next and we'll press OK. So it just verifies the postcode and then it automatically tunes in the channels very quickly for that particular region. So you can see there it's brought in 166 TV channels and 37 radio channels. OK, so we'll press the OK button on the remote control to save the channels. And at this stage now, it'll ask you about your broadband connection. This uh, box is um, capable of internet functionality, like uh, we'll say, like the BBC iPlayer, uh, the ITV player, uh, 4OD, and um, I think it's called 5 On Demand, which will be Channel 5's, um, you know, catch-up service. Now, at this stage, we're not going to connect it up, uh, but you can. All you have to do is simply plug it into your router, basically using an Ethernet cable. Uh, there are Wi-Fi adapters also available for this particular box, and um, that you could connect it up over Wi-Fi. But you're always better to do it um, by just connecting it up. So I'm just going to say skip this step. Um, at this next stage, then it'll ask you for parental control, and you can set up a PIN code. Um, you know, to lock people out of the box uh, that might, you know, they might upset the settings or things like that. So if you want. You could do that at this stage by just selecting the pin code, but I'm just going to say skip this step. So it's um, basically it. It says it there on the screen. That's it. You're done. Uh, and we're going to select start watching free sat and press OK. So that's it basically in a nutshell. Just take you through the first time install on the Humax HB1000S HD uh, free sat receiver with free time.